Sister. Go. Did I just... Oh, fudge. I just missed. We picked out our starter Pokemon, Rowlet, the most adorable owl in the entire game. Uh, and, yeah, we're going to see what comes after that. <clears throat> we have to go talk to uh, Commander... Captain? Captain. Silene. And, uh, yeah, here we go. It seems you won't have to leave... <laughs> Sorry, I was concentrating on this paper. It seems we won't have to leave you to die after all. Congre Congratulations. You passed your trial. You can now hold on to that sigil. I must admit, you've impressed me. I set a high hurdle to judge whether a stranger like yourself could be worthy, but you cleared it. This is yours, the official uniform of the Survey Corps. You received a Survey Corps uniform and a pair of Survey Corps sandals. That would be better than my flip-flops. Get changed, get changed in the room you used last night, then you're to report at once to the third floor. Present yourself in uniform to our commander. This is your first official order from your captain. When you're ready to get in your uniform, make sure to use the mirror in your quarters. Okay. Easy enough. Alright. I really want to turn these field guides off. These are actually getting annoying. Um... Unfinished tasks. Oh, I guess I'm still on that. That's fine. All right. Now well, we'll finish it up real quick. I'm not going to fuss too much over it. All right. Let's get changed. Oh, I didn't even notice this earlier. That's a very non-reflective mirror. Yes, I want to change my outfit into my uniform. Uh, oh, I, I guess I get more clothes. Cool. Survey Corps uniform, Survey Corps sandals. Wait, wait. I can change my color. Ultramarine. Ooh, these are cool. Okay, hang on a minute. I gotta do this. Uh, red, maybe, maybe. What is ultramarine? It's like really, really blue. Super duper blue. Pale blue, hazel, let's do white. All right, finish changing. Yes. That looks better. You changed into your Survey Corps uniform. This big old comfy sandals, too. Look how well your Survey Corps uniform suits you. It's almost as if the captain had it tailored just for you. I see you've changed. Regarding your accommodations, you may continue to use the room you slept in last night. You may wear this as well. A hat. Now, present yourself to the commander. So the commander's in the third floor. This is the second floor. These stairs are funky. Wait, what's in here? Hang on a minute. I'm going to explore just a little bit. Hey. Pokemon are full of mysteries. I hope you can help us solve them. Get Pokemon to help with our manual work? No way. That's crazy talk. Okay. Y'all are very not interesting. Up, 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 up. And the commander. <laughs> 
definitely got a walrus voice. I've been waiting for you. Is that a kimono? It's pretty sweet, actually. I am Kamado, the commander of the Galaxy Expedition Team. Hmm, so you are Enigma. Yes, sir. Hmm. I have been briefed on your situation, including how you fell from the rift in the sky. Now then, let's see what you're made of. Wait, battle? Yeah. Mm -hmm, okay. Try to throw him or charge at him. I charge at him. Yeah. Well then, mm, you've got vigor, I'll give you that. You need to work on your sumo technique, but I do see some potential. Do not expect a warm welcome from everyone. Naturally, some will be slow to trust an outsider who literally fell right out of the blue. The superstitious among us might see your arrival <laughs> among us again. Yep, there it is again. The superstitious among us might see your arrival as a po 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 What's a portent? Okay, hang on a minute. Uh, one minute, one minute. We need to get a definition here. Portent. P-O-R-T-E-N-T. -E That's an actual word. Okay, okay. Portent. A sign or warning that something especially momentous or calamitous is likely to happen. Right. And three... Okay, so, I, oh, I've been on face cam this whole time. Oh, well, you all heard, I, I read everything. You, you didn't miss anything. And 3,000 poke dollars as well. You'll have to buy the necessary material. Akari, you are an expert at crafting yourself. Teach our new recruit what he needs to know. Of course, Captain Silene. Now, as the experienced craftsperson here, let me explain a bit to start with. Crafting means making items with your own two hands. You can buy some items in the general store, but self-sufficiency is worth striving for. You can make even our most valuable tools, pokeballs. Think where we'd be if we couldn't do that. Let's head to the craftworks. Okay. And I didn't activate the guide this time. Visit the Craftworks to learn how to craft items. Okay, well, that's what we're doing this episode. Halfway into the recording. Well done, earning a place in our team. My name is Anthe, and I'm the... <laughs> and I'm the local clothier. Alright, so I'm going to have to change her voice. She's definitely got, like, the mom voice. She's got the... Does she, doesn't she have the mom look? The professor asked that I ready you a change of clothes, so here you go. I do hope they fit. Another set of clothing? <laughs> everyday kimono and a pair of everyday trousers. Alright, alright. I hope you avail yourself of the village humble shops. This way to the craftworks, Enigma. Okay. Flowers. You, I wonder. Mm, I wanted to see the flowers. Dang it. You can use the workbench here at the craftworks anytime you need to make an item in the village. Okay. Okay. And I'll supply what you need to make your first pokeballs once you're ready to begin. Call it my way of saying congratulations on joining us. Just spend the money you got from the captain on clothes or whatever else you think is best. Go up to the workbench and choose an item to craft, in this case a Pokeball. Uh, craft benches in Jubilife Village and base camps. Crafting items requires recipes and the same materials. So it seems like the base camps kind of work like Monster Hunter where you like have a area to explore maybe? We'll see. Alright, so craft a Pokeball. And there's the things, a uh, Epicorn and a Tumblestone. Um, I mean, I might as well just craft them all, right? 
I made 20 Pokeballs and put them in my satchel. Well, that was easy. Complete. Well, <laughs> that's the end of the episode. Thanks for much. No, no, no. Nope. All right. Oh, ho, ho. That's some fine craftsmanship. Hard to believe this was your first time stepping up to the workbench, my boy. Yes, all I did was press a button. You recall, of course, that Pokemon possess the odd power to shrink themselves down. With the Pokeballs we craft, we can make use of that power to catch them. Also, that more Pokemon species can be duly recorded in a Pokedex. Now, see, I actually, I mean, <laughs> when, when, when... Uh, when I was a, a, a young enigma of 10 years old, I actually thought that the Pokeballs were the technology that made them shrink, not that, that Pokemon had the ability to do that themselves. So, okay, okay. And on that note, here you are, Pokedex. Pokedex. A volume for compiling the... Compying? <laughs> A volume for compiling the collected results of much Pokemon research. Professor Leviton continually adds to it with each report made on a new Pokemon species. Uh, tasks with unreported data, 8, 500 points to reach the next rank. Okay, okay. Right, so these are all the starters I didn't get. Oh, wait, no. <laughs> Report to the professor about this new species you've managed to catch. Okay, whatever. Exit, exit. I prepared this following you just for you. I hope it aids you well in your aim to seek out all Pokemon in this grand region. That was really difficult to read. You'll have to complete lots of research tasks to help the professor fill out the Pokedex. The same goes for me, of course. I've also got a num uh, Pokemon to research as a Survey Corps member. I'll be all too happy to explain more about the research tasks I could use your assistance with. Come join me at the Fieldlands Camp whenever you're ready to go, my good enigma. Alright, getting to work, 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 that's a new word, right? Getting to work on research tasks. <sighs> hey, excuse me, I couldn't help but over here. If you're going out to the Fieldlands Camp, would you mind taking a request for me? I'm standing guard, so I can't leave my post, but I'll be here at headquarters if you, if you want to talk about it. People who have something to ask of you will have a request icon displayed above them. Alright. Alright, alright. Alright, 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 alright. Give me that request, bro. Hey, so there's this Pokemon called Wurmple. Have you heard of it? Uh, yeah, I have, actually. Well, you see, I was having a chat with Professor Laventon, and he told me that after a Pokemon gains a certain amount of experience through battling and the like, it'll sometimes change its appearance and become stronger. He said it was a po phenomenon called evolution. Some of Pokemon can undergo evolution, changes their appearance and stats, blah, 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 blah. And so I decided that I want to raise a Wurmple myself and have it evolve. You're a part of the Survey Corps, aren't you? If you catch a Wurmple, could you let me have it? There'll be a reward in it for you, I promise. Just get me a Wurmple if you can. Wurmple can evolve. Alright, cool. Uh, let's see. Wait, I meant to do this, I guess? Alright, cool. So, I'll scoop up all these requests and then we'll... um. Head out, I guess. Alright, so... There's a request down there. I thought there's one. Alright, lady. You're the newcomer that fell from the sky. Are you heading outside the village? Of course you are. The Survey Corps must have... To get out and about to compile that... Pokedex... Book they're working on, right? Well... On your way, kindly do me a favor, find out all about Starly. Pokemon certainly are terrifying creatures, but when I see Starly, I feel simply whole. Not that I have the least desire to actually touch one, mind you. 
Please let me see Starley's entry in that Pokedex the moment you've completed it. Oh, I gotta talk to the uh, professor. That's that's right. All right, so let's let's scoop up all the requests and then uh, we'll see if we can't talk to the professor. I know Shink's ears had odd markings on the inside, but what were they? No use. I can't remember. This. Oh, excuse me. This will keep me up all night. Hey, aren't you with the Survey Corps? If you catch a chinks, could you show it to me? I've got to see one with my own eyes. Please, I can't remember for the life of me what those ears look, look like. It's driving me up the wall. All right, all right. Uh, I mean, I can actually complete this one now. Come to think of it. Yes. Shinks. Select. Oh, he's so adorable. Alrighty, let's have a peek at those round ears. Yep. Bloop. <laughs> he's so cute. That's it. It seems to have a yellow cross pattern on them. Kind of like a star. I can't tell you what a relief is. this is. I felt like I had a bone stuck in my throat. Only the throat's my brain and the bone's a thought. Thanks for helping me get that bone out. Right. Anyway, so let's see here. I've got to report back to the professor, I guess. Uh, how do I do that? Where are the... Let's see here. Getting to work on research tasks. Okay, cool. We'll click on Evolve, Adorable Starly. All right, so yeah, let's head out to meet the professor, I guess. Yep, we're going to the Obsidian Fieldlands. Thank you. I love it. Righto, let's get to it then, shall we? In order to complete this Pokedex of ours, there are a great many research tasks. I'll need your help to carry on, my boy. The details of these tasks can be found in the Pokedex for you to reference anytime. Research tasks are tasks you need to carry out to complete the Pokedex. Each Pokemon species is a different number and variety of tasks. Press the down button to open your Pokedex and see what tasks you have to do. When you focus on wild Pokemon, you can instantly check the research task by pressing the down button. Okay, whatever. You must catch and battle diverse Pokemon species and carry out plenty of research tasks. Do so and you'll gain research points and other rewards for your work. One last piece of advice, Enigma. If you see a wild Pokemon's attack coming your way, dodge like your life depends on it. Dodge? Here, watch closely and remember what I do so you can do it later. Hup. Dodge roll. I'll take it. That beautiful flowing dodge is a bit of... Uh, <laughs> that beautiful flowing bit of gymnastics Dicks. I don't know why that word was so hard, is what we call a dodge. If you're light on your feet, you can dodge out of the way of a wild Pokemon's attacks. That way, hopefully, you can avoid taking a beating and blacking out in the wilderness. The security corps had to collect me when I got the business into some Shinx's Thundershock. But don't worry, I got lots of experience to draw on and I'll teach you plenty. Okay, okay. All right, so let's do some research tips. There's a dodge. I'll take it. Let's learn how to research, and then we will uh, see what's next. Now, let me share some Survey Corps wisdom. Focus on a Pokemon with the ZL button and then press the down button to open the Pokedex. You'll see what tasks you have for that Pokemon. You might have noticed that you have a research task to do with how many Bidoof you've caught. 
That's right. Catching just one isn't enough. You'll need two, then four, then more and more. <laughs> He's like, that's right. And when it's time to battle a Pokemon, remember the captain's switching wisdom. If you have items out, press X to ready your Pokemon. Give it a try now if you want. I'll go on ahead. All right, Badoof. Follow Kari to... Pokeball, go! All right. I got a spoiled apricorn for that. All right. Ooh, there's another one. So let's see. Um, I need to catch several. I need to catch several heavy ones. I need to defeat several. And apparently there are two different forms. And I need to evolve one. And apparently there's a mission. I'm assuming what that last one is with the method unknown. All right. All righty. Uh, well, let's catch another one. Come here, my Badoof army. Oh, you stinker. Fine. Let's fight. Uh, a fight. Gust. Fight. Leafage. Alrighty. Roll out. Oh! It's super effective. A critical hit. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Leafage! Okay, I defeated Badoof. Alright. Alright, uh... How do I use a potion on, on our friend here? Oh, like that. Okay. And then can I... Favorite. Lovely. I don't know how I use my favorites, but there they are. Okay. This looks... Ah, there we go. It's a leak. It's very medicinal. Alright, and Badoof. Nice. Oh cool, we leveled up for catching. I'll, I'll, I'll take it. I'll take it. I think you've got it, but as a reminder, don't forget to open your Pokedex when you focus on a Pokemon and check your research tasks for it. Just ZL and then down. Try checking your tasks for Sterly next. Okay, okay, okay. One of your tasks is to catch Sterly without being spotted, right? For that task, try catching them while hiding in some tall grass. Uh huh. I'll go wait for you up ahead. Come catch up when you finish some tasks. I just did some tasks, thank you very much. All right, so Starly. We're going to sneak up on a Starly. I'll look at him right there. Unaware of what's about to happen next. And Pokeball, go! Did that one see me? You snot. You stinker. Fine. Uh, Let's get out Shinx here. All right, Starly is keeping its guard up. Starly, oh, you sneaky snacky. Okay, okay. I see how this goes. I heard something. Did I just... Oh, fudge. Fudge him, fudge him, fudge him. I just missed. I just missed. Alright, fine. Whatever. Fight. Quick attack. Go. Fight. Quick attack. Go. Ah, uh, of course you ran away. Yeah, well. I meant to do that instead of throwing... Shanks out there, so 
Oof. Are there any other Starly or did I just chase them all off? Oh, there's another one. We're going to come around here. Dingus! Those are some sneaky Pokemon. All right. Number you've caught without being spotted. Number caught. Now, was I technically spotted? Because you kind of ran away. Okay. 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 Alrighty. Well, I think that's going to be the wrapping up point for this episode. So thanks so much for watching. Catch you in the next episode and take care.